All right, everybody, final recording of the session. I'll be able to read your comments after this one for the last eight episodes. Welcome to Craftverse episode 32. Thank you for hanging around and watching the series. I hope you're really enjoying it, or at least partially enjoying it. Otherwise, what are you doing here? There's other cool series I have on there, another cool series on YouTube. Don't settle just because you're supporting me. I greatly appreciate it, but you should be enjoying it. Oh, look, a bow. All of the things I don't need. But it's good for experience. Also, these guys are annoyingly noisy. Right, Let's get some more levels. Maybe I can then enchant the spoon again. Alright. Okay. Back to fishing. I'm also waiting out a few days of not sleeping so I can start to get phantoms and probably try to kill one with my looting sword so I can get a phantom membrane. Because I do not have the patience to grind cats. I mean, they will spawn in some of the villages that I've seen, but... I've tried venturing out, and the game doesn't want to load. So, you know, we're just... We're just fishing. Just chilling. The last few episodes have been very, very beneficial. I was able to get respiration and aqua affinity on my hat. So I don't think I'm going to be able to put Depth Strider on the boots. If so, it's probably going to be 33 levels itself. But I got my wings. Flying around. You know, as that goes I want to do. Trying to fish up some books to see what I can do. Got a really nice one right here for either a mace or trident, which I have a trident farm right next door. And there's at least one village that keeps popping out babies, so might be able to go ahead and get myself a cartographer. Possibly slap on some maps, some mips. Which one should I go for first? And I will see your answers before I actually use any of the information. Woodland Mansion or Trial Chamber? Which one would you go for first? Bear in mind, the loot's probably going to be crap, except for the mace. And possibly Windburst 1. A bowl? I'm not even storing that. Get out of here. Wait, when did I get iron boots? Had to have been from the mobs. Because you can't fish up iron boots. Alright, speaking of mobs. You know, I realized that when I started this eight episode recording session, I had every intention of building a trading hall or finishing my iron farm. Yet again, it has not happened. Of course, Curse of Vanishing, but everything else makes it an almost perfect pull. Hold on. <laughs> okay. Aside from Curse of Vanishing, it'll heal itself if I go killing some cows. But it has mending. I would have to get an infinity one, and I'm not going to waste that on Curse of Vanishing. I mean, does it really matter? Because if I die, 
Chances are I'm not going to find where I died anyway. Oh look, I'm breaking three. That's not infinity, but it is a bow. And it knew I was talking about bows. Is Minecraft starting to work like Amazon? Or your phones? Another bow or crossbow enchantment. Alright. It's like I'm talking about bows and I'm getting a bunch of stuff for bows, whether it's enchanted bows or enchantments for bows. Maybe I should talk about emeralds and where did... Do I have any on me? No. Go away. Can I get something for a fishing rod? Like, perhaps a fishing rod itself that is enchanted. That does not have a curse! Can I even have Curse of Binding? Can you just not switch out from holding it? That would suck. Fishing Rod PvP? You'd have no other option. You would have to use it until it breaks. And can you, can you imagine if a Curse of Binding Fishing Rod had mending on it and everything you killed gave you experience and healed it, prolonging the experience? Why did he just die? Oh, he got stuck underneath. What? Guys. I was literally talking about getting an infinity bow, and it gives me an infinity bow with Curse of Vanishing. Okay, Minecraft is officially scaring me at this point. They're listening. It's a smart TV that's channeled into Minecraft servers. They hear you when you're fishing. They make you shit your pants. Oh no. It's just a llama bobbing up and down in the water because he killed his master and his fellow llama. I told him I didn't want to go out for a walk today. He didn't give me a choice, so I'm going to make him go for a swim. Oh, well, you can't breathe underwater? You're not a fish? Well, don't take me for a frickin' walk, then. Slowly bobs away from the crime scene, not looking back. He knows what he did. Nope, oh, nope. Oh, called him out. Told you, they're hearing me. He's going to spit at me. He's going to know that I, I know what he did. I don't know how he knows, but he knows. He's coming right for me. He's like, someone's just told my crime to the world. And I have to deal with that threat. The player's gotta die now. Clearly the mobs inside the cage in there cannot do it. Even though they're mostly explosive. So it must be done by Llama Spit. Okay, what the... More power. Is it safe to say I've got unlimited? Nope, I'm not going to say the whole meme. You thought I was going to do it, but no. I refuse. You know what? I'm saving the world right now. Death to a murderous llama. Who knows how many villagers and wandering traders he would have stricken in his quest for vengeance. All because he got on a walk he didn't want to go on. Proof. Llamas are evil. There's actually a really funny story involving llamas in my, my childhood. So I have a little brother. Right, who is 
Down syndrome and not quite all there. Yes, they are separate things. They they are not mutually inclusive. Um, we were on a farm, and he was like twelve at best. And on this farm, they had alpacas, chickens, llamas, and one of the alpacas. He, Let's just say was on a a power trip in his pen, trying to establish dominance over anyone who would respond, dominating the airwaves. He's a very obnoxious beast, and my folks were in another building trying to look through shoes and stuff because it was like a communal building, and uh. My brother and I were in the van. They had left the back door of the van open so they could easily load stuff in. So we got a front row seat to the llama's orchestra. Okay. This llama, alpaca, whichever one it was, decided to yell at my brother for about 30 minutes straight. And I know he was yelling at him because my brother was shouting in whatever language his brain can speak because it's not English. I can assure you of that. And they were just yelling at each other back and forth and the, the animal was looking directly at him through the open door of the van. And I'm just sitting there like, dude, he's baiting you. Why are you losing an argument to a llama? And he just kept turning around and screaming at the animal. Like, All right. I, just, I had no words. I just, I couldn't breathe. I was laughing too hard. It was funny. My mother comes out of the building like, what the hell is going on over here? Uh, he's losing an argument to a llama. I don't know what to tell you. I, I can't make him turn and face away from the llama because you left the door open. <laughs> and he can hear the llama. That, whatever he's saying is super offensive is all I know. It, it was genuinely the funniest thing I had seen to date at that point. I was like 14, 15. <laughs> I've never witnessed someone have a verbal argument with a llama before. I don't think I ever will again, because there's no way he's ever going to go anywhere near another llama. It, it just won't happen. He, he's got, like, trauma from that incident. So every time I see a llama in this game now, I think of that moment. And oddly enough, the llamas in this game are pretty on point with the sound effect. Thankfully, the one in that pen didn't spit at us because we had the back door of the van wide open. All it needed was enough force and trajectory, but I don't know how good llamas are at math. Also, I wasn't even fishing at that point. I was just talking. <laughs> didn't even realize I didn't have the bobber out. Alright. How have I not once found a fishing rod? Riddle me that. How have I not found a fishing rod yet? And I've gone 20 levels in like 3 books. No, three bows, two books. And that guy has a pokey fork. I can see the, the line of the stick. I don't know if he even notices I'm up here. 
he might be too far away. I don't know if you could see him either. He's down there to slightly to the left of the bobber. I see his little face as he's looking around. Like I'm loaded in, so obviously there's a player nearby. Where the hell is he? Got a lot of fish so far. I might actually be able to trade with the, the fisherman at my main village. You know, the one who's trapped in a pen. I didn't put him there, he put himself there. He's in timeout for some reason. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and grab these. And then grab that. All full stacks of items. Okay, y'all can chill. I'm trying to clean out this one singular chest I have. Probably wasn't a good idea to only have one chest, but you know, that what I have to deal with. You know what? Just gonna put that there. Make that farm only. Full items chest. Probably gonna be like level 50 by the time I find one of the books I need. Uh, full, 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 full. Basically full by proxy. Any other stacks want to fill? Don't look at me with your feisty little eyeballs. That's rude. Da -da 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 -da. Alright. Uh, not bad. Okay, I'm not listening to the gulping. If I kill nobody else, I'm killing that bitch. <laughs> Back to fishing. This is like day two or three of no sleep. And by the time I load back in after the next couple of weeks, uh, I'm going to forget that I was out here for phantoms too. Another power bow. I'm just going to load in, be standing right here, and be... Uh, why is there a phantom... Aiming at my face. Because you know that's what happens every time I take a break in between recording sessions. I forget what I was doing. Finally! Don't have Curse of Vanishing. Oh. Aside from mending, you're perfect. Okay, you can you can go up there. You're staying with me. Actually, I'm gonna go fuse those now. So, oh, I did get three books. I'm gonna move these books out of here. 
put that where it's gonna go. Yeah, okay. Quickly get these guys out of here, a couple extra levels. And then go fuse my fishing rods. Guess I'm not gonna see 35 right away. Uh, might as well grab a couple extra pieces to junk. Very careful not to throw out the fishing rod that I need to use. That would suck. I finally get one and then I lose it, even if it's the exact thing that I need. No idea how many levels this is going to cost. But we're about to find out. Hello, horsey. Did not bring one of the saddles with me. So you're just going to have to sit there and play nice. With whom? I do not know. Maybe you have a chicken friend. Or perhaps a spotted cow. All right, it's probably going to be that one, and then this one, that's 10. If I do it the other way, it's 16, yeah. The only thing you're missing now is mending. I don't have a spare one. Actually, I'm going to stick you in the ender chest. Where is my potion? That one's too good to not. As is that. Okay. No sleeping. Still on the hunt for phantoms and good books. How How did it know those are the exact enchantments that I still needed? Now, I probably should have activated my wings. But literally, all I needed was Unbreaking 3, Lure and Luck 2, and Mending. The only thing it didn't give me was Mending. Is the next book I get going to be Mending, or am I going to get another rod that has Mending on it? I used exactly 10 levels for that. This should be much faster now. Oh yeah. Noticeable difference. Whether or not the loot's going to be a noticeable difference, I'm not sensing it. All I've gotten so far is fish. And not the magic fish. Just the regular fish. Is that the exact same fish? Okay, I've got one salmon. Everything else has been caught. Oh look, a slightly different fish. How did I reel that back in? Another card! <sighs> oh look, another rod. Does it have mending? That would be so beautiful. <laughs> you can't make this up! You cannot make this up! It's the only other thing that rod needed! What? I think this is my favorite recording out of all of the series so far. This is just... Just what? How does that happen? I'm telling you, it's like a smart TV or a smartphone. They're literally listening to everything I'm saying right now. They're like, oh, he needs another rod, or he needs mending, or a rod with mending. Hmm. Let me just give him all of those things wrapped up in one. I'm going to name this Big Brother because clearly they're listening.
All right. Now I'm like half of where I was just two fuses ago. But I never need another fishing rod again because I'm not going to lose this one unless I die holding it. And it's literally the best fishing rod in the game. Nice. I have no words for that, honestly. It li literally could not have gone any better. Literally nothing else I needed on that, and it gave me the one thing I needed, and the perfect amount of XP on it after fishing it up to make it full health. Just I've never had that happen before. Okay. Next fish, I'm killing that witch. Okay, that's fish. The game has decided that you must die. This is like the Matrix, and the Matrix has decided that you must die. Okay. Give me a book. That looks like a book, but it's fish. I'm gonna be honest, that's the one thing that bugs me about fishing from higher up, is that the, the salmon look exactly like the the uh, enchanted books from high enough up. It's confused me between which one I got several times. Like, I'll think, oh, it's just a salmon, and then I'll go and check my inventory, and oh, nope, that's a book. And it had something I was fishing for. Okay, cool. The next book will be the end of the recording. Let's see what the final of this recording session is going to be. How long it takes. I'll leave it up to the game. The game has been kind to me today so far. It gave me literally everything I asked for and things that I didn't. Okay, I was not going to be waiting for that one. It just wasn't going to happen. That one, though, is just a fish. Drum roll, please. Nope, just a fish. Also a fish. Oh, just watching the shading change for the lighting. Oh. Ominous. Same exact fish. Can I at least get a puffer fish? Something different than a cod? No, I can only get cod. Okay. Oh, there's the puffer fish. It was just a delayed reaction. They had already sent in the code. It's fine. And back to Cod. Hey, Salmon, the son of Cod. And you have puffer fish, his fat brother. It's fine. But do they read book? Nope, they're just fish. Fish don't read books, what are you talking about? That's why they give them to you from the fishing. They don't need those. Unless they make little fish houses. Then I'm not sure how good of a roof that's going to be. 
Make it soggy. Eh, they're used to foliage, it's fine. Come on, book. That's not a book. Book, 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 book. Oh. Okay, well. Intermission. Must murder. This chest is dang near full yet again. Bruh. That's even after separating full stacks, separating fused bows. I've literally pulled 25 fish since I've been over here. Now this is the longest this mob grinder has been active, so... I can't complain too much. Hundred and ninety two days on this world, and I already have wings. I can't believe I built a raid farm before I got wings. That's one of the most dangerous things you can build. Besides, you know, using TNT for something. Well, I missed whatever that was. Hopefully it rolls over. It's a puffer fish. It's very round. I suppose it could roll over. Oh, it's a sporadic fish. Yep. He couldn't decide if he was fated to die or not. He is now forever food. I may be here for a minute. For some reason, I had better luck when I only had level 2. Maybe it's because it's not raining? Where's the rain? Uh, uh. I'm done. I don't know why, but the second I said it's not raining, it's raining. Okay. Now just give me a book. It's nighttime, it's raining, I have maxed out fishing rod, just give me a book. There's no excuse not to pull a book at this point. That's close, but not a book. That's also not a book. But the rates are much faster at this point. Dang, that was fast for being a shell. Alright. Standing on the chest. An act of treasure. That's a string. That's fish. Come on. Give me a book. Everybody in the comments, just type in book in chat. That's the first tropical fish I've got. Come on. Book. I missed it. Book. Give me a book. If you made it this far in the video, just type book in chat. Or in the comments. This isn't live. <laughs> oh, my brain is mush at the moment. I have no idea what's going on. All I know is I said the word rain and it's raining.
should only be one more night of no sleep in order to get phantoms too. Okay. Okay. Nearly perfect fishing rod. See, this angle's really throwing me off. I am going to keep going until I get a book. So if you want to save your luck for next episode, give me a book. Otherwise, I'm going to keep making you listen to me. Like the big brother satellite dish you are. That's not a book. Okay, they're toying with me now. Maybe if I look at the back of my noggin, I'll find a book. Someone's always trying to beat me over the head with something. Let it be knowledge. Let it be magic. Let it be an enchanted book. Give me your secrets, River. If I care what the book is, just give me a book. At this point, I've gone 10 minutes over my allotted time. I should uh, be ending off. But no, I'm determined to get a book. It will happen. And watch it be mending. They've listened to everything else I've said so far, so the book's got to be mending. It, it's just guaranteed at this point. That's the first tripwire hook I've pulled. Alright, you guys are noisy. At least there's no witch, but y'all are noisy. At this point, I've gone well over my two hours for this particular allotment, so... Might as well commit. Come on now. Don't be a sassy one. Uh, gave me a bookmark, but not a book. That's a lily pad. Everything except a book. Fine, I'm going to actually say I don't want a book, and it's going to give me a book. I'm going to be able to make so many water breathing potions. It's going to be awesome. That starts with B, and uh, it's not a book, but I'll take it. Enchantment? I need it. I don't have a problem. You have a problem. I'm sitting here watching a crazy man fish. It's crazy. We're both losing our minds together. Along with our minds, I just lost that fish. Okay, 
Okay. Second tropical fish. Come on, you're well within the rain. Okay, I'm gonna give it another minute. And if I don't get an enchanted book before the 42 mark, that's too long. That's not even an, an enchanted fish. Come on, we've got 15 seconds. Ten seconds. Oh. Well, that's not a book, but it's a bow, and that's going to have to do. Alright everybody, have a wonderful night. I'll catch you in the next recording session. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Watch, I'll, I'll get a book right as I'm ending the video. Nope, that's a fish.